So one day, I come across these images on Facebook, and like any YouTube channel that is solely based around railroad videography, I thought I needed to come and visit these trains. This is the number one YouTuber in the world, and I had to see these trains for myself. So what did I do? I booked a flight, the first one, out of Denver, going into Charlotte. So I'm here. I arrived in North Carolina, but I can't seem to find the trains anywhere. I had a friend tell me exactly where they were, and I could not seem to find them anywhere. I even tried to find them with my drone, but to no avail. There's two Mr. Beast locomotives. They're painted in Mr. Beast colors, and I'm on the hunt to try and find them. A rail fan told me exactly where they were, and they are not there anymore. So I'm going to have to track this down myself. Wish me luck. Oh, fuck me, dude. So I have confirmed from my buddy that they have moved the trains into a shop around here. So the game plan is to try and find where that shop is and where these trains are being held. It's also these crazy purple looking lights. I don't know what that's all about. All right, I'm gonna have to contact some of the, the guys that know the spot and see where the heck the shop is that they're talking about. And here's another one of those weird purple lights, just so crazy. All right, so I'm on my way to the one of these shops and uh, you know I'm gonna try and get inside of one of these shops and see if there's a Mr. Beast locomotive in it I am NOT going to vandalize it at all I just want to look at it and make a video and that is exactly what we're gonna do right now I'm on my way to the shop This is it. This is the Mr. Beast locomotive. Hopefully there's not anybody living over there. Fuck. Okay, well here it is guys. The Mr. Beast train, 711. And the other one over there is 777. This is definitely not a clickbait video guys. This is the Mr. Beast train. See, 711 Beast. This is the train, guys. There's the 777. And it says Beast right there. So I'm pretty sure, yeah, the Mr. Beast train, it's literally just unlocked right now. Holy shit. Holy crap. I can't believe the train's just unlocked like this. It's fucking crazy. Whittier, 7.50 a.m. 
September 29th, 2022 was the last time this was taken out. Great Smoky Mountains. Damn, sick. There it is. Beast. This is the actual train. So sick. Yeah. There's Mr. Beast again. Whoever did the graffiti did a really good job. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Here's the train in all its glory. 777 and 77, sorry, 777 and 711. And the Mr. Beast logos are on the back and they're wrapped up right now. I showed you guys some videos of that. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy the tour of the trains. And I'll be uploading this after Mr. Beast uploads his train demolition uh, video. So yeah, see you guys in the next one. But I think it's here to stay His thumbnails Well, they made in paint But if you ask me I think they're kind of quaint Mr. B6000 Oh, oh Mr. B6000 Oh, oh It's random videos Are the name of the game Some might say They're a stick to fame The occasional intro May not make sense But we all get along at their expense Mr. B6000 oh, oh. Mr. B6000 oh, oh. Mr. B6000 oh. Mr. B6000 Give the orders. Large cheese. The train's coming! Will the brick wall stop the train? Oh my god! Oh, it's coming! <laughs> there it is. Oh, oh my god! Oh my god, bro, it snapped it in half. All that remains is... to be sick.
Welcome to Great Scenic Railway Journeys. Hi, I'm David Holt. It's been said that the best way to see a country is from the footplate of a locomotive. It's also a great way to appreciate the toughness and ingenuity of our ancestors. The story of the Great Smoky Mountain Railroad, tucked away here in the far southwestern corner of North Carolina, is one of endurance. It's a story that begins with the land. Imagine a world where the sun rises on a land only lightly touched by the hand of man. Oh! Perfect beard. Mr. Beast.